Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys have been here before, if you guys are new, hi, my name is Krista. So today I wanted to film a little chit chat, get ready with me type of video. I haven't filmed a video in a very long time. I actually did film a video, I think a few weeks ago, but I didn't like how it turned out. So I just didn't post it. Um, but I thought this video would be fun because I can show you guys my new products and how I do my makeup now and just update you on everything that's been going on in my life. So if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell. That way you'll be notified whenever I upload. And without further ado, let's just get right on to the video. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is put my hair back so it's not in my face. If you guys see me looking here, it's because I'm looking at my mirror. Um, so to start off, I'm going to use some primer. I'm using the e.l.f. Jelly Pop Dew Primer. I'm literally almost out of this. It's my favorite primer, and it's really cheap, too. So I love using this primer as, like, my first primer. I use two different ones. Oh, I'm just going to all over my face. I usually don't wear foundation every day, um, but I have this little friend right here and he doesn't he doesn't want to go away. It's been a few weeks and he's still there. So I'm going to actually put on foundation today. Um, and then I'm using the e.l.f. Um, Poreless Putty Primer. And I use this on my T-zone. I feel like I don't get as oily when I use this, so I do that. Next, I'm going to be using the Rare Beauty Illuminating Primer Base. This is relatively new to my collection. I really like it. it gives you like that subtle. Okay, so I put the primer on. This is what it looks like. Just really illuminates your skin and I really like it. It's not like too in your face, which I like. Um, and the next thing I'm going to do is put on the L'Oreal Infallible 24 Hour Fresh Wear Foundation. I love, love this foundation. It's my favorite drugstore foundation. Um, it literally covers up everything and it looks really good on camera too. So I'm just going to dab this all over my face. Okay, so this is what the foundation looks like. I like it. I really like blurs out everything and cover up my little my little friend is all covered up which is nice so but before I continue on with my makeup I want to talk about everything that's happening in Ukraine right now um it's so tragic everything that Putin is doing right now it's literally out of selfish re reasons and it's not okay um everything that the Ukrainians are going through is not okay they're losing their homes they're losing People are dying. People are losing their life. Children are dying. People, they're getting bombed every day. It's literally so horrible. So I'm just asking everyone to um, just look into like the news and like stay up to date with everything that's happening. And if you can um, donate to any of the resources that are available, um, just to like help the Ukrainians out. Um, I literally have no words with what's happening. I've been following everything since day one and it's just, I, it, the only way I could describe it is tragic. Everything is happening for literally no reason at all. Um, and I wish there was more that I could do. Um, I can only spread awareness and I'm gonna look up some resources and I'll leave them down below in the description box if you guys wanna look more into it. Um, but yeah, just try to stay up to date with everything that's going on and I stand with the Ukrainians. I don't understand why Putin's doing what he's doing out of the only thing I know of is he's being selfish right now for <laughs> literally no reason. Like what he's doing isn't right at all. So I just want to show my support um, to the Ukrainians and for your bravery and just everything that you've been doing, like fighting and just how brave you've been. It's very inspirational to see how you guys have been handling everything so um yeah i just want to i just want to show my support for ukraine and spread awareness of what is happening with russia and ukraine um and like i said i'll leave some resources down below so you guys can look more into it and maybe um if i can find some reliable like um sources where you can like donate or do any of that kind of stuff i will leave that in the description box below as well so next i'm gonna go in with concealer i'm using the um color prop pretty fresh concealer i usually only use this on a daily basis 
um i feel like this is enough for me so usually if i'm not wearing i hope this is okay my camera died so i had to change the battery um but usually like i was saying if i'm just wearing concealer and powder i would just drag the concealer down really far and just use that as my foundation it's a lot more um it's a lot lighter than actual foundation like the coverage um so usually i would just do that but because i'm wearing foundation right now i'm just gonna put it right under my eye and keep it right there and the next thing i'm gonna do to kind of brighten up my under eyes a little bit more is use the rare beauty concealer um i'm in the shade 360w for shade reference so for this i'm just going to concentrate this like in my inner corner and right out here um so i guess to kind of update you guys on like everything that's going on right now in my life so um i think the last time i filmed a video was like first semester um, so for those of you who don't know, I'm in graduate program studying for my master's in healthcare administration. So currently, like I said, I'm in my second semester of my first year, and this is a two-year program, so I'm kind of almost halfway there, which is crazy to think about, because I just feel like I just started the program and I'm almost done, which is crazy. So yeah, that's currently what I'm doing. Um, I'm a full-time student, so... A lot of my time I'm spending in class and doing meetings and all of that kind of stuff, group work, projects, it's a lot. Graduate school is no joke, <laughs> like it's a lot. Sometimes I even wonder like what I'm doing back here, <laughs> like why did I even come back to school? Um, but no, I like what I'm studying, um, I'm hoping I can bring about a lot of change with this. Um, degree so you know we're hoping for the best hoping that it works out the way I want it to um, but yeah that's what I've been doing I just I've been school has been hectic I have to worry about school and also finding an internship um, for the summer so it's like a requirement for my um, program that we find or we have an internship to graduate so and that's been stressful that's been so much fun trying to do all of that um what else have i been doing next week i have technically i had three exams but one got canceled which is so nice um so i have two exams next week i'm really worried about one of my exams so i really need to study for that um after that i have spring break so it'll be so nice to just be able to relax and not do anything i just want to literally not do anything i just want to stay at home and sleep um that seems like the most relaxing way to spend my spring break right now because for the past few weeks i haven't been sleeping properly at all um, I've been getting very few hours of sleep, so it's it hasn't been fun. Um, so I'm using the um, what is this? The flower flower beauty, I think it's called um, blush balm in the shade cinnamon. So I'm just gonna take a little bit on my hand. I'm just gonna take that much. For highlighter, I'm going to use the Rare Beauty highlighter in um, Transcend. I'm just going to take a little bit of this and just put it on like my finger. I don't want too much because it's like, like we're not doing anything serious, you know, so I'm going to put a little bit on. I'm going to set my face using the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. I've been using this for years and I absolutely love it. After I um, put on setting spray, I always go back in and I kind of just dab everything into my skin. I feel like it just helps it soak in a little bit better. It makes it look a lot less cakey. Now I'm going to move on to my eyebrows and I'm using the Benefit Precisely My Brow Pencil. I'm going to fill them in. I don't really do much. 
to fill my brows in. They're pretty full already. I kind of just fill in like any bald spots that I have, like right here, I have a bald spot. So I'll just fill that in. Okay, so now I'm just gonna set my brows with, um, it's the packaging, like the lettering, it's all gone. Um, but I'm gonna use the Benefit Brow Gel. Um, I'm pretty sure this is in the shade five. There's literally, literally nothing's on here. It's like all rubbed off. Um, but I'm just gonna put this on my eyebrows to kind of set them and tint them a little bit more to make them darker. Not that I need to make them darker, they're already dark as it is, but you know. I like my brows to be dark. Okay, so now I'm just gonna do my eyeshadow and I'm gonna do this off camera because it's gonna take me a while, but I'm not doing anything special. So I'm just gonna do it off camera and then I will come back when I'm done with it. Okay, so I just finished my eyeshadow. This is what it looks like. It's nothing special. Um, that's usually what I do whenever I go out. But now I'm gonna put on some mascara and I'm gonna use the Essence Lash Princess Mascara. I'm gonna curl my lashes first. I'm supposed to leave here around five. Um, and it's already three o'clock, which gives me like a lot of time to like get ready. Like I got ready really, really early. Um, but I figured if I got ready really early, then I can just, you know, study for my exams, just do homework and stuff while I wait to actually leave. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I think I'm just going to get ready, like actually like put on my clothes and everything to go. Okay, so this is pretty much what the makeup looks like. Um, it's pretty natural-ish. It's not like too much, I hope. Um, I wanted a little bit more with my eyes than usual. I usually just throw on bronzer and I call it a day. But I kind of wanted to line it a little bit, so I used some shadow to line my eyes. So it looks a little bit different than my usual. I just need to do my lips and then I'm like actually done. But I think I'm going to use the LA Girl lip liner in chocolate and I, I don't want it to be like too much so I'm just gonna put on some gloss. I'm gonna use a Maybelline Lifter gloss and this is in the shade of stone. I'm gonna line my lips really fast. Now I'm just going to put on the lip gloss. Okay, so that's about it for the makeup. This is pretty much all I'm doing for it. So now I'm just going to put on my outfit. I think I have an idea of what I want to wear, but we shall see if I actually do end up wearing that. I usually... I usually always have an outfit in my head and then I'll put it on and absolutely hate it and then I'll just go through a whole like little fashion show of all my outfits and then I'll usually just go back to that first outfit that I put on. But yeah, so I'm just gonna go put on that outfit and then I will come back and that'll be it for this video. Um, but yeah, so let me go put on the outfit and I'll be right back. So I just finished getting ready. I spent so much time putting on different outfits just to come back to my original outfit. It's like an hour later, so I need to head out soon. But I just quickly wanted to show you my outfit and then I'm gonna leave. But uh, so the outfit I chose to wear is, I'm just wearing some black jeans, um, some black booties with it. And I'm wearing this black bodysuit and this grayish black jean jacket. I'm gonna wear just a plain black purse. For jewelry, I'm wearing my usual go-to earrings. I can link these below. I got these from Amazon. And I'm also wearing this K necklace that my friend got me. And I'm just wearing these rings. And yeah, so that's my outfit. If you guys like the video, like I said before, please give it a thumbs up. And yeah, so, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.